Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. I am in my bathroom right now because I'm about to do my hair and I wanted to take you along with me and show you how I style my hair super quickly using the new Dyson Airwrap. <music> So this is my new Dyson Airwrap styler right here. I already opened it and ready to start using it. Probably you've seen a lot of videos and reviews on this product already because I feel like it created so much buzz around hairstylists and YouTubers who make beauty videos in general. And I was curious to try it out myself. I was really excited about it. And at first I couldn't justify the price myself because it is so expensive. But at the same time, I felt like Dyson does such amazing products like the vacuum cleaners and um, air cleaners and everything. So I really wanted to give it a try to basically check it out myself and yeah, ease my life a little bit while doing my hair. I hate doing my hair because I am so bad at this and this thing is supposed to save me so much energy and I just wanna be stress-free when doing my hair. I've tried this already and this is such a great product. It is super easy to use and it gives amazing results in the end as well. Also, in the reviews that I watched, a lot of people were saying, oh my God, it takes around an hour to do my hair, but it isn't true because the very first time when I tried it, yes, it really did took me a long time, but the other day when I was using it, it actually only took me 15 minutes to style my hair from the scratch. So now I wanna share with you my techniques on how I do it in 15 minutes, which is so fast. And yeah, if you're curious, if you're interested, then keep on watching. So I'm not gonna do an unboxing or anything because I already used it so many times. And uh, basically there is not much to show. So what it has, I have these two barrels. This one is 1.2 inch or 30 centimeters. And this one is to create more waves. This is the one I'm actually using because I have short hair. The other barrel that I have is um, the 1.6 inches or 40 centimeters. And this one is to create more volume and bigger waves. So I wanna try this one as well, but for now, this is my favorite one. And also they come in pairs. So I've got two of this and two of this. And the reason I have two is, do you see the arrows? And basically they show which direction I should go. So if the arrow goes to the left, then I should do it on my left hand side against my face and then I have this freestyling tool. It is, it basically looks like a tiny hair dryer, but it's really strong and I love it so much. And lastly, what I have in my set is this firm brush. I didn't get the soft brush because I have the shape and control package, I suppose, because Switzerland didn't sell the um, complete versions of the set, but they had volume and something and then um, something and something. So I got one of those. I think I didn't go for the volume. I went for the other one. Oh my god, I can't remember the name, but um, I'll put it down. And basically it came with this firm brush. I never tried it, so I only used the smaller barrel. Uh, but when I want my hair straight, definitely I'd go for this one. But for now, I'm just enjoying having this wavy looks. And this is the whole set. So now what I want to do is prepare my hair. And I'm going to use two products. First, I'll apply this one right here. It's from Schwarzkopf. It's called BC Bonacure Hair Therapy Cell perfecter 
there it is and basically it's um it's like a conditioner but in a spray so when i brush my hair i don't hurt myself The next product that I want to use is this one from Le Petit Olivier and um, basically it has olive, argan, what is it for? It moisturizes my hair, it hydrates my hair, if it makes sense, um, but um, basically it's for dry hair and I love using it because my hair is really dry and um they become sort of electrified i don't know how you say it in english but that's how you say it in russian because they just you know every time that i put a sweater on they start to float and move a lot and i hate it that's why i need to use this and um, i really love it it's such a great product now i'll quickly brush my hair okay so i'm ready to start also i've seen a lot of people doing this uh division of the hair so putting them into two or three to separate them um i can understand it it's smart to do that but it really takes a lot of time and if you're in a rush you don't really care separating your hair into sections you know so i'm not gonna do that I'll just show you the quickest way you can use your Dyson Airwrap to style your hair and look like a superstar. First, I'm gonna use the pre-styler. Okay. I'm done with the pre-styler. Basically, you wanna make sure that your hair is damp when you start using the barrels or whatever you wanna use, like the firm brush. Basically, you want your hair to be almost dry, but not really, a little bit wet. And also make sure that your hair isn't too wet because Dyson doesn't like it. The barrels, at least, they don't suck on your hair and yeah, they just don't want your <laughs> wet hair. They want it down. And I'll start with the back part because it's the easiest. So I'm going to start off by using this one on this side and yeah, let's just, let's just go. As I said, I'm not going to divide my hair into sections, but I want to get rid of the ones that I don't want at the moment. Because otherwise it's going to try and take them all. <laughs> you don't want that. I put it on the maximum heat and then once you're done you want to pull the thing up for the cool air and then just let it go there you have it super fast and easy And there you have another one. So I'm done with the bottom part. It looks cute. Now I'm gonna move on to pretty much the rest of my hair. Beautiful. This styler is my favorite one at the moment. It is so easy, it is so fast to use. I love it. Right now, I can't even imagine my life without it, and I don't regret buying it at all and spending so much money on it. it it's, it's worth it, guys. 
I mean it, it's worth it. If you know how to use it properly, then life becomes so much easier. Also, I love that the heat does not exceed 150 Celsius because if you use an iron or something like this, usually it goes up to 230 degrees, I guess, where this one is totally safe for your hair. It does not damage it at all. And there you have it. I want to change the barrels to do the other side of my head. I'll do this quite quickly. So I am done with both of the sides. It was so quick, like this part I finished within maybe three minutes. And now what I have left is the middle part. And the reason I did not touch it is because I want to do them backwards from the very start. So it gives me this nice volume, which honestly I never have. Now I'm going to show you how I do that. Also guys, when um, doing your hair backwards, you need to make sure that you're using the right barrel. So not the left one, but you need to change it to the other one with the narrows pointing to the right. And then you let it go. You see? Can you see the volume? Amazing. done with my hair so this is the result and it really really only took me about 15 minutes in total to create this kind of crazy look of course you need to brush your hair but um, I want to let it cool for a little bit just a little tiny bit and then we can gently brush it so we get these beautiful, beautiful waves. Now let's quickly brush it. So here is my final result. I think it looks so pretty, especially since my hair is really fluffy and it's all over the place it just looks messy all the time unless i do it and i could never achieve this result until i got my favorite dyson aerob what do you think and i love the volume everywhere i usually never have 
any volume on my roots and look at this now it's amazing for me can you see it for me it looks fantastic and i love this soft waves they look so so pretty all right guys so i guess this is it for my today's video i hope you enjoyed it and i hope i showed you that you can actually use this and create this look within 15 minutes isn't it crazy i hope you liked this video if you did don't forget to give it a thumbs up also consider subscribing to my channel by pressing the red button down below i'd be super happy to have you back for my next video and i can't wait to share with you what i'm planning to film right now it's gonna be great thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in my next video bye